Good morning family and friends. The love, joy and peace of our risen Lord be with you all. In today's birth readings focuses on the unity of the church. In today's first reading from the Acts of the Apostles we see as the number of Christians grew their problems and divisions also took place. And many people ask me why there are so many denominations in the church. There are 2.3 billion Christians and more than 30,000 denominations in one name, one master, one savior. In John's Gospel chapter 17 we read Jesus himself prayed, "Father, as we are one that they may be one." Then why these divisions? It's simple because we are all human beings with differences of opinions. Today's first reading we see that Gentile Christians should receive circumcision and follow the Mosaic law there was an issue so people brought it up to the apostles let us learn how early christians overcame such division first of all they brought it up the issue they did not consider everything is going pretty well they addressed the issue secondly they did not gossip among themselves they brought it up to the concerned authorities and the told disciples in in turn they addressed the issue they did not sweep under the carpet and not only that they sought out the wisdom and guidance of the holy spirit and brought it up for the discussion what a great example for all of us to learn when we go through divisions differences of opinions first of all seek the will of god and guidance of the holy spirit secondly face the issue with courage and 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 inspiration the division was from the very beginning but you know every christian is linked to christ and linked to each other and this this bond christ himself wished it that's why he said i am the vine and you are the branches and the vine and you are the branches but a vine is all branches it is It is not like a tree or a big shrub where it has a substantial trunk and profusion of of branches. It's just branches itself. Branches produces the fruit. So it's not just a relationship. It's identification. Jesus identifies himself with us. I have some experience of taking care of a vineyard in Pine Wood. Vine is a very delicate plant that it needs it requires a lot of care and attention the young vine is not allowed to produce fruit for initial 3 years so it is drastically pruned a vine produces certain shoots called sucker shoots sucker shoots will suck the life out of vine so every vine dresser knows how to prune these sucker shoots is painful for the plant but it's for the good we know god prunes us for our own betterment we know where our church is persecuted more and more we get stronger vocations and stronger faith so what do we learn first of all we are the branches jesus is the vine and our heavenly father is the vine dresser the vine grower so we have to produce fruit in order to produce fruit what we have to do we have to stay with the vine we have to be in relationship with the vine and receive the power and source from the vine that is jesus christ himself as saying john paul ii said our division prevent our neighbors from hearing the gospel as they supposed to remember united we stand the wider we fall and we also celebrate the memorial of our lady of fatima as we celebrate this memorial we know we have a mother who who unites us who protects us let us intercede here in procession remember again might we stand the wider we fall may god bless you all in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy spirit amen